everybody, it's Rory from ANS Gear. We're going to look at some combat shirts today from TrueSpec. Um, so if you have ever, or if you're into the military style, the woods ball, the scenario play, whether it be airsoft, paintball, whatever that, uh, that particular avenue you have traveled down happens to be, um, and you have a vest set up with a lot of stuff on it, you've got all these molly accessories and smoke bombs and grenades. I don't know what you guys carry in your vests, but you got all sorts of stuff inside of there. Um, and you're wearing like a normal like BDU or ACU jacket underneath it. It gets hot, it gets sweaty, it gets uncomfortable. There's too much material in those, those particular um, blouses or jacket setups. It bunches, it's just uncomfortable to wear that heavy, heavy top and then load a vest on top of it and a bunch of accessories on top of that. So they come up with these uh, combat shirts which help kind of eliminate that problem. You have on the chest area, the arms, the chest, we see right here, it's a very, very thin, very lightweight, I think it's like um, a 60, 40, yeah, 60% cotton, 40% nylon. Um, it's made to be comfortable, be lightweight, to absorb sweat, to get it away from your body. Um, these particular ones, they call them no melt, no drip because if they're exposed to very high heat or very hot temperatures, they won't melt or drip like polyester and potentially burn you. Now, for the applications that we're probably using them in, airsoft, paintball, you're not gonna see anything like that. But for a military person, that would be very important for them. Um, so no melt, no drip, absorbs uh, sweat better than cotton, evaporates it better than cotton, keeps you more comfortable. Um, uh, the breathability is as good as cotton, so it's, for this section right here, where you're gonna be loading a vest on top of you and all the accessories, to have it be as comfortable and as thin and protective as possible is the best thing you can do. Now the arms, on the other hand, the arms are a thicker material because those are exposed outside of your vest and they're gonna be um, uh, ripstop material. So if you do happen to get a rip or whatever, it'll help keep that to a minimum. On the side of the arm, you've got a zippered pocket right here that does go all the way around underneath this Velcro right here. So you can put stuff down in there. You've got the Velcro so you can put uh, patches or names or whatever you want to put on there. Reinforced and actually slightly padded elbow right here. So this is going to help keep your elbow safe, but also to help keep the material itself from strip or uh, from um, getting holes in it, uh, from shredding apart, from just ripping in general. And then the bottom has a Velcro cuff where you can control the overall size of your cuff depending on how you want it to look, how tight you want it to be. So you get that on this side. Now on the other side, it's gonna be pretty much the same setup. You do get a, a different kind of Velcro loop on the top side there so you can hook some things on it, maybe pen, pencil, whatever you wanna put inside there. Well, I guess a pen and a pencil really wouldn't work. And then uh, another pocket right there. And then the same padded elbow, reinforced elbow, and um, adjustable cuff for the wrist. Now on the back side, you got that nice soft material down there, and then up towards the top, depending on how your vest is gonna load out, they've got the same ripstop material up towards the top um, to keep the whole look proper. Now this is gonna come in a bunch of different colors uh, we've got two out here right now. This is the Desert Digital with like the coyote front here or the tan front. Underneath it we have the um, Army Digital with the foliage or olive front right there. You're going to see them in all sorts of different colors. You're going to see um, multicams and uh, ATAX and just Urban Digital, black, tans, olives. All sorts of colors are available. So depending on what your loadout is going to look like and what colors you're going to be wearing, you can find a combat shirt that is going to fit your style and fit your play, uh, your play style and be comfortable for wearing heavy vests, light vests, whatever the vest top may be, and just for wearing in general. If you, maybe you're not going to wear a vest on top of it. It's still going to be a nice lightweight um, setup with some protection on the sleeves, and you can wear it that way too. So definitely check them out. Uh, these are combat shirts from TrueSpec. They're available in all sorts of different sizes and shapes and colors. So check the website for availability and order yours now through ansgear.com.